what's going on guys today we're just gonna be riding for a short amount of time on the skateboard today i got a few errands i gotta run in my truck but i will definitely jump into a conversation with y'all when i get to my truck i do want to talk about the ohio state game and the lsu game so if you guys want to hear that stay tuned that's people behind me we're gonna go ahead and take off So I don't know if you guys just heard, but I did get yelled at by somebody and they asked me to come over and step over and talk to them for a minute. And I was kind of in a hurry, but whenever someone stops and asks me about my board, I have to tell them something because no one's used to seeing that around here. But I didn't really want to walk up on the guy with the camera and see what his thoughts were on it. He really was amazed by it. He wanted to know how much it was, how, much, how fast it can go. I did tell him that I didn't think he should ride it. Yeah, that was a little, little risky right there. I cut that corner a little too fast. I did not see that car coming down this back alley. There never any traffic back this way. And considering that they were, a little bit scary because I just hit a really bad bump and I could have ate it. Maybe he wants to be on camera. Who knows? I almost ate it. Yeah, man. That car came around that corner. But that's the thing. Like, it, it can eat potholes. That's the thing, like, I hit a bad one over there, and luckily it took. Yeah, I thought I was about to eat it, man. <laughs> hey, really good for community purposes. And we're back home. There's my truck. We're just gonna go up here and turn around. Home sweet home. So I'm gonna have to do this kind of like this. Um, sorry if you don't like the angle or whatnot. But after getting yelled at by the old man about getting a speeding ticket or whatever, whatever, it was pretty funny, but let's get down to business. We're here to talk about some football. Let's go ahead and talk about yesterday's game with Clemson and Ohio State. All in all, it was a fantastic game. It did start out really rocky for my boys. And uh, Dobbins on Ohio State, their running back, their running back really is insane. Like that man can run the ball. I never wish injury on anybody, but if he didn't go down that game, we probably wouldn't have won that game. All shits aside, Dobbins really was carrying their offense. He had two explosive run plays, which both should have ended in touchdowns, but luckily one didn't. So the Ohio State game, all in all, great game. 
Better luck to you next time. The defense... Chase Young is a monster. Chase Young is going to be exactly like Aaron Donald whenever he gets into the National Football League. He's going straight to the NFL, and he's going to do damn good at it because he was all over Trevor. Trevor is a really quick running back, or a quarterback, I'm sorry. I'm thinking about Lamar Jackson now. But uh, he really is an outstanding defensive back, whatever you want to call him, or edge rusher. He's really good. I'm not going to put anything past Ohio State. They really did come in and show out, but the top dog comes out on top. So Clemson's moving on to the national championship. Let's go ahead and get on to the LSU and Oklahoma game. Ha! Ah! That was a fucking embarrassment, my dude. Like, let's go ahead. I got to turn my heat off. It's getting hot as shit in here now. But the Ohio, uh, not Ohio. Oklahoma, that was pitiful. That that was pitiful. Utah, for some reason, should have been number four because that was a pitiful play. It was a pitiful game at that. So, better luck to Oklahoma next year. Jalen Hurts, I thought he was going to bring him in and do what he could have done in Bama until they released him, but, man, that shit's crazy. I did not think that they were just going to walk all over Oklahoma. I low-key wanted Oklahoma to win because I knew that they were going to be an easier opponent than uh, LSU in the national championship. But Tiger versus Tiger, you can't beat that, baby. Let's go. So, I hope you guys did enjoy this short little vlog. I really am appreciating all the support from you guys. I want to wish you guys a happy new year. Sorry about not being able to get any fireworks on camera. It is still daytime, and tonight we getting drunk. We getting drunk drunk. So please be safe out there, guys. Uh, it is New Year's. There are a bunch of crazy drivers out. So I'll catch up with you guys next time. And another little side note. If you guys are enjoying the videos, please like, comment, and subscribe. It would really help me out a lot and the channel. So please be safe this New Year, guys. Thank you. So I didn't even think about it. Let's go ahead and talk about the LSU versus Clemson Tigers. So I really do don't want to be biased in this, but I do believe that Clemson Tigers will take it. Not just because that's my team in my hometown, but you got to think. LSU's defense is not anything special. They had countless teams put up way too many points against them. So I think Clemson's going to come out with a explosive offense and our defense is going to play stout like usual. And I think our defense is going to win us the game. So I think LSU is going to go out. I think Joe Burrow is going to ball out. I think he's going to get at least four to five touchdowns passing, no rushing. And I think Trevor's going to get four passing and then ET is going to get two rushing so we're gonna win by I want to say four points I don't want to give it too much because I really do believe it's gonna be an extremely tight game so let's go man this is a hard decision now sitting here thinking about it I'm gonna put Clemson at 38 LSU 34 like I was saying, those are my college predictions. Make sure to let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Have you, Has your team already been knocked out of the playoffs, or are they still in it? Let me, got, let me know in the comments below, guys. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell, and support me and the whole Eastgate community. Thank you, guys.